Alright guys, this um, this video is going to be the start of hopefully a series of videos on camping or the way we the way I'm going to camp in Jersey. It's not hardcore camping with primitive sites. You cut out your own little camp area and you have at it. This one actually has a picnic table on site. You know, each cutout is its own campground and you have a fire ring with a controlled uh, fire, campfire. Uh, it also has a hose spigot, so you have clean water, and it also has uh, one electrical outlet ran to the campsite in case of emergency, if you need power for whatever reason. So that's an option for me. We're going to try our best not to use that when we don't have to. Um, I, the stuff on the table is only a few things that I purchased for this camping trip. I, um, what you don't see here is I purchased a Coleman uh, camping stove that runs off of propane. I uh, bought it like a 10 person tent because only because I got four people we're all gonna sleep in the same tent only because my five-year-old is not gonna do good by himself in the woods for the first time and my niece she's 13 I don't know how she's gonna do in the woods she's been let's say sheltered her whole life uh, she's never been out in the woods so for the first time Everybody's going to sleep together in one tent, so I bought a 10-person tent for four people. So, or I should say three and a half people. Five-year-old doesn't count. Um, so anyway, this is some of the stuff uh, that I want to test out while I'm out in the woods. And I'm going to go through it real quick and explain to you what I got here. This here I bought as a, at a Dick Sporting Goods. This is uh, the Gerber Hatchet. And a knife. The knife, I believe, slides in the handle. I haven't opened it yet. When I do the video out in the woods, that's first I'm going to open it. I don't want to open it just yet. But uh, it comes with the sheath for the head of the hatchet so nobody gets cut. Oh, look at that. It's actually open. I didn't notice that when I, when I purchased it. But that's all right. We're going to see what kind of damage we can do with this. I'm not worried about that. Um, uh, these are... Just little things. I got a bunch of these little things like sprays and tick stuff. And these are match holders. It actually has matches in it. So we're going to try out these little matches. No big deal. For shits and giggles. I want to try this can opener. Like if I did get stuck and I needed one for emergency. I want to try that out. Um, all right, before I get to these two little flashlights here. I went to Harbor Freight. I was a... Uh, Checking out a couple things. I actually bought a welder. I bought a drill press. That's for the future. Uh, for future videos, I'm going to describe and tell you why I bought them. I went to Harbor Freight. I had a nice coupon, 20% off, blah, blah, blah. They have an 18-inch machete. It doesn't feel like anything special. It was very cheap. Uh, with the 20% off, it was like less than $10. So, I figured let me try it. If it snaps, it snaps. I don't want to open it until I get out there so you guys know I didn't do anything ahead of time. So, with that, and I bought this, again, I think this was like five bucks. This comes with all the stuff inside, the matches, the compass, sewing kit, uh, fishing kit, you know, the typical stuff. I wanted like a little Rambo knife type deal. See it? So I want to try that out, but with that, if I separated the purchases, which I had my wife with me, she bought one, you get a free flashlight with each one. And I'm sure the flashlight ain't anything special, it's, there were two bucks a piece they gave for free. I'm looking to see how bright this thing is. Three AAA batteries, blah blah blah. I don't even think it tells me how bright it is. But... One thing it does tell me, it is made in China. So I don't expect too much from it. I only got it because it was free. And my son, my five-year-old, wanted a flashlight, so we'll see how they work. Also, at this campground, they have a pond. It's catch and release. Now, yeah, do I consider myself a fisherman? I'm a every now and again fisherman, but I fish out in the ocean. I go for blues. I go for stripers. You know, stuff that you find here on the East Coast and the Atlantic Ocean. Um, flounder, fluke, whatever you want to, you know, go for. Um, they have a pond, so I actually went and bought two fishing poles. 
These are Walmart specials. They were, I got two of them for 30 bucks. No, I wasn't going to go crazy. It comes with all the little baits and the bobber and all that stuff. I'm not a freshwater fisherman. I mean, I'd like to. I want to teach my son how to fish. So if you guys have any tips out there on how to do this or how long I should set the bobber or the drag down, whatever, just let me know. And also, I know the last couple of videos I showed you guys these flashlights. Amazing. I love them. And I haven't really done a very great, a very good uh, review on the big one that I have here. And right now I'm trying to get the T-Rex, the which is actually bigger than this one. Uh, the T-Rex one is actually a 1,000 lumen, lumens. This one's 800. So when we go out in the woods, I'm, I'm going to do a nice review on this one and show you how bright this is. All right, guys, so that's it. If you have any questions or... Oh, the other thing I'm doing, uh, right now I got uh, I got something in the works right now that I'm trying to get MREs, you know, meals ready to eat. But um, I need a guinea pig to try it out. So I told my niece if she wants to go and have a good time, she's going to have to, we'll prepare them, but uh, she's going to have to eat them and uh, get on video and show me whether she likes it or not or tell me whether she likes it or not. So if you guys have any ideas of... Uh, what you want my niece to try out and keep it clean guys she's going to be our guinea pig on this trip she doesn't know it yet i mean she knows about the mres but she doesn't know that i want to try and get her to try all different things i'm going to have her because she's a girly girl you know she's makeup nails this and that so I, i'm going to have her out there trying to catch frogs or or firewood or just whatever you know camping does i want her to get and know what it is to be outdoors so if you guys have any uh, ideas please don't hesitate let me know and um, I'll try and get as much on video as I can all right guys thank you very much and uh, look forward to seeing you guys again talk to you later